Hello and welcome everyone to part 8 of the Carthage Let's Play for Hannibal at the Gates. We continue following on from last time we made some good pushes west but we're now being attacked by the enemy forces. We will obviously have the walls to defend here with the brethren of Baal, the elephants and everybody else even though they need to replenish up. We will um, fight this battle because I don't like the auto resolve um, remaining force. I reckon we can do a little bit better than that. Considering a lot of the enemy is uh, cavalry, we should be able to hold them off. Plus the mighty, mighty power of the elephants should not be um, underestimated. They only have three kind of um, skirmisher units, missile units, the slingers there. Should be able to deal with them. If we can deal with the uh, Lusitani, then we'll be able to push them away for good. We need to spend a lot of money, though, rebuilding um, the, I think it's Ebora. And the other various places we've just taken. Because they've all been trashed a little bit. But if we can do that, stabilise the economy a little bit more. The annoying thing is, I got managed to add uh, another edict to this province, which we've done uh, bread and games. And I'd love to add it to my Carthage province, or um, or similarly along the North African coast, but I don't hold all the regions there, unfortunately. So we've started over here. The enemy is coming in from over there. There's the ladders. What have they got coming up on them? Iberium sword. Iberium? Iberian. Swordsman, well, my Libyan infantry aren't in great shape to face up against them. We're going to leave actually two of them back here. We're only going to send these guys over here. Although, actually, we can use the pikes to hold up here. As the enemy comes off the wall, they can charge into my pike wall. But, of course, we will have my Peltas and, uh, and Javelin men to meet them and hit them. Hit them with the Libyan... Javelin men and Peltas all around here. Um, I assume they might try and go for this gate rather than that one. We'll see. We'll have to obviously move around when we know. Carthaginian hoplites, we're only going to use a kind of selection of them as well because we are pretty weakened. Keep these guys back around. I'll keep them at the main gate here. Libyan infantry, Libyan infantry we're going to keep here just in case we need to charge on in. Take them off formation attack. General with the elephants up over here. Carthaginian Cavalry. Now, I'm kind of thinking I might have them here and, and sally out up through the mountain. Oh, uh, wait, we can't get down from the mountain. Damn, I thought it was a pass over the back. Okay, no, we won't do that, but we will send them this way, around the back of them. Natural sort of valley to help protect us. Hit the Iberian Cavalry, perhaps. That's a, that's a big perhaps, because they do have a lot more cavalry than I do. I don't want to risk my guys. Now, these guys are going to be group uh, 9. Just to keep them out of the out of the way, you'll defend the uh, the tree, the sacred tree. Um, so we haven't turned this Carthaginian yet, so we need to do that. Ballista, perfect. You guys, um, I don't want to hit the sacred tree. I think we'll have to put you here. So in which case, I'm going to move my general over here. Ballista should be able to fire from here. Hopefully, I think we might just clip that house. We'll find out. Um, let's just do, do it like that, and then they should be able to fire. Not a problem. Okay. Right. Let's start the battle. Can we hit them yet? Yes, we can. Good. I want you to hit this one first, please. And go. Go, Ballista, go. Um, oh, I don't know, we can't use flamble around because it's raining. Otherwise, that would have been good to try and burn down the uh, the ladders. And I am going to at least move my cavalry out here to hide in the shrubs. Um, at least it ma maybe draw the ca cavalry towards me, the enemy cav. We'll see. But if not, it's to swoop down and take out these Iberian swordsmen as they get towards the walls. We'll hide them in the forest here and then pop them back out. As long as the cavalry enemy cab doesn't move forward, we should be fine to do so. We see the ladder slowly coming on in. Ballista's doing a number on these guys actually as they move forward, which is good.
keep taking them down, which will be much appreciated. All my skirmishers. Oh, damn, I grouped these guys together with them. Whoops. Um, group five, then. Skirmishers. Keep on knocking him down so that cavalry doesn't come on in. We're all good. Skirmish is going to take care of that first ladder. And I believe the ballista is taking care of the other one. Back over there. Time for the cavalry to intercept these ones. Time to stop firing there, everyone. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. We smashed in. Do I see anyone charging? It's their general. Ballista, you can hit their general. We've broken their spears straight away. Let's pull the cavalry back, ready to charge back on them. Ballista, though, can wreck these guys. Okay, put these guys back on fire at will. Should be able to have them. They might be able to get one of these ladders to the walls. We're going to charge back in, though, to make sure that doesn't happen. Stop firing again, guys. There we go. Cavalry gets the charge on in. Ballista is trying desperately to destroy the Lusitani nobles. They're not sending up their cavalry to protect them. He's got a sword unit as well. We can probably hit their general. Hyperion swordsmen are shaken. Cavalry pull away. Enemy general's dead. Cavalry, pull this way if you can. Pull, pull, pull. Cavalry this way. Run away, run away, run away. Cavalry, 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 run. There we go. Managed to get them away. Now we can hit them from both sides. Their cavalry's not interested in coming on in. They're sending more slingers, which is good. And we're managing to whittle away at these guys quite nicely. Veteran shield warriors are the only ones that are going to cause a lot of trouble. Cavalry to hit the slingers at the back here. Veteran Shield Warriors will smash on into them. Ballista is out of ammo. And my Peltas. A lot of them are. And we'll pull these guys back, which works fine for us because that's the, uh, the ones at the most danger anyway. Smash these guys in the back. Pull on back there. Charging on into the skirmishes. Oh, they've got their cavalry coming on up now. Need to pull the cavalry back. Back, 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 back. Time to run away, Cav. Time to run away. Run, men, run. No. You're getting squashed. I don't want to lose you on purpose. Run, Cav, run, 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 you're fine. This unit of Cav managed to make it away. These guys are just going to make it. Just. Somehow you've just managed to make it away. Keep running. No, don't stop. I don't want to lose you, you really good Carthaginian cavalry. Putting out with the elephants now, bringing out the elephant card. Because they'll be able to take down the uh, the enemy cav nicely. Oh no, they've caught up with me. No, 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 no. Damn. Just please survive. Please survive some of my cav. If we have to lose one, one unit, I guess that's acceptable. Elephants. Finish off their cavalry break them for killing ours. Got them trapped at the front there. Fortunately, couldn't pull them back in time. But absolutely wrecking their cav now. Which is all good with me. Give them stampede for whatever little charge bonus they're going to get here. Yeah, we've broken all of them. Shattered cav. We don't get a chance to continue to chase them down, but that's okay. That cavalry, unfortunately, they got the most kills, but I think we might have lost them. Damn. 
256. Peltas doing well holding the enemy back. Ballista as well, 226. Held the Lusitani at bay. We killed 972 of them. My towers took down another uh, 200 odd. Total loss of the enemy, 1,222. Down they fall. Yeah, my cavalry did go. Damn it. I'll have to re recruit some more of them at some point because they're very good cavalry. Most of them are going down. The cavalry still remaining. They'll pull back, War. face attrition, finish them off. Oh dear. Our ancestors love it. You, I expect to see mewling like a woman. Cool. None of their allies joined us, but all of mine did. Uh, uh, more people to be at war with, though. Great. Just great. We have fine goods, and you doubtless have much that we would find desirable. So, are we to have... Sure, we will have trade. We will have trade. I and peace treaty. That my Lord yes, we will have peace. I'm cool with that. That holds that whole piece of block. Where me? Oh, awesome! Everyone wants to peace with me now. Yay! And they're offering me monies. Yay! Keep offering me pieces. What the? Rebel army. No, my garrison will not be able to hold here. Protective stance. They're going to take um, Ebora back. I'll have to push back over there because I, I left it and pushed desperately for um, Olipsio. Too, too much. Peace negotiated. Edict cancelled. Bread and games in this new province. Mission failed because they've just taken Ebora back. So I'll have to take that. Resource lost. So these need you to all replenish. And I've lost a unit here, which is sad. Um, right, we can go for COVID action. <clears throat> we need to repair all of this. Or ideally convert it. That is a lot to convert to. Um, horse pens. So we can convert to one of these brick layers. We're going to... Um, we'll actually get some money, which is rather useful. Ah, just to that, though. Well, we're going to have to go for it, aren't we? Because we can only repair it because it's not ours. That army there. I could push out and try and push these guys back, but I think we're going to have to wait a turn. We're going to have to be patient now. Uh, we must hold up here. These guys are not at war with us. And we can probably just about hold up here with what forces would remain. Uh, it's increased weapons. We're going to save our money for now. Boss him. Yes, I know you need to upgrade. I know everyone wants to upgrade. We're pulling this army down to Isle. And these guys are now safe down here. Oh, no, they're not from the Catuli. Uh-oh. What if we can try and sue for peace? No. Um, would you like trade? Success. Yay. Would you guys like trade? Would you guys like a non-aggression pack? No. Would you guys like trade and some money? That's it's ill with me, so I say no. Yay! Accepted. Okay, trade. Trade is key. Trade is important. Um, you guys really should be trading with me. I'm not your friend if you won't accept my trade. Oh. I am right. sure you have many pleasant Nope. Okay, what's our economy up to? A little bit. It's getting like an extra 200 from that, so that's, that's okay. That's okay. I can deal with that, mate. <clears throat> right. Still holding here with Hannibal. If we can sort out what's going on over here in the west, my main army will be able to recover Ebora. Which is good. But I believe these guys are going to attack me. No, we're not at war with you. We are at war with you. I've chosen this wonderful time to try and attack us. And my other armies are in no good shape. These guys... Uh, yeah. Um, Sega. Or Sega, rather. Trying to sort you out. They've got a large army coming towards you. The elephants might be able to just hold. 
Um, we really should be pushing down. Still keep pushing down from Isle to try and get to these guys. We're going to keep on coming down. Isle will just about hold. Uh, we've got the fleet here. Normal stance we can leave you in. Carthage, right. That is everything sorted out, checked up on. Let's end the turn. The Lusitani taking attrition, pulling back. I don't think they've got any settlements left, so they are going to crash and burn. I offer this in the name of our people. Let this be a sign of goodwill to come. Huh, they could become my client state. And it would mean I wouldn't need to take um, that settlement back. They're offering money, they're really willing to bow down to us. I'm going to accept that for now. It means I don't have to worry about distracting my force over there. It means I can pull that army elsewhere. Oh, at least I do have a settlement up here. Okay. That's good, actually. It's nice to see the AI kind of responding to power a little bit. I'm not sure. Depends what sets all these off, really. And I thought I would probably be attacked here. Oh, dear. Well, we're going to have to use those elephants to try and pahone the enemy. Or at least as much damage as possible than my army from Iol which is probably about 800 odd strong, can then finish them off. Those slingers. Dem slingers we need to watch out for. Hopefully just let them come down the streets, charge the elephants through their ranks, hit them from behind with somebody else, and uh, pray to Baal Hamon that uh, we'll be able to pull it off. Okay, so here's our collective army and garrison. Put the hoplites and the militia together. And the enemy's coming straight on in from this way. Perfecto. Well, we're actually going to... Hmm. If they come into this bit here, then we can charge on through with the elephants. And then these guys can slam out from somewhere else. So we're going to have these guys... We're just going to form up here, let them enter the square a little bit. And then charge through. You do manage to hire some mercenaries last um no term before last. Take you guys off skirmish mode. Infantry at your command. Mob, we're gonna see if we can flank on round with you and smash through from that side. And I think that's all we can do. Oh no, we've got the uh got the ships. More javelin men. This may well be our saving grace. We're gonna have to get you guys to land here straight away. Quickly, quickly, quickly. But yeah, we're gonna let them enter the square. Because trying to pin them up here, there's going to be peppered by slingers, and I want them to enter here, break up a little bit, spread on out, and then the elephants can go mental. Sending in their spears first. It's good as long as they don't back them up with all their skirmishes and tribal slingers too quickly. We're okay. So many tribal slingers. Noble infantry with their spears. You are now part of group two. Well done. Welcome to the fold. As you wish. Form up all of you here. We now have our own number of skills. Now, if they come on down and attack this way, that's great because we can bottleneck them here, which is how we won last time. Um, these guys are still going to stay here for now. We're going to fast forward to find out what's going on. And they're all coming up that way, which is not good. Yes, they are sending units here. Which is a right pain in the arse, because I then can't defend against them all. Um, but elephants should be able to, on their own, charge down and take these guys out. They are all moving down here, which again is fan ruddy tastic. Javelin men. All form up here, if you wouldn't mind. Hoplites. If you wouldn't mind, form up here. We need to pull the elephants back through very quickly. And um, we need to charge in. Oh, this is going to be mental. Numidian spills. And 
gonna charge down with the elephants first. Skirmishes, I don't want you firing just yet. Our general is under attack. I'm not gonna stampede with them either just yet. Keep on pushing, elephants, keep on pushing. Broken that first unit. Pull back out with the elephants if we can. If not, no, we're going to go mental. There we go. Break all of them. Nimidian cavalry. They're trying to hit us, so I can't try and pull them out. Okay. Elephants going berserk. That's fine. How to go out of control. That's fine. You're right in the middle of the enemy. So if there's ever a time to go out of control, now is that time. We're not going to engage my missiles just yet either, though. They're desperately trying to kill my elephants. No, just don't turn back toward me, elephants. Don't turn back toward me. No, 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 no. Pull out of the crazy elephants way. Oh, I've managed to take down one of my elephants. They're out of control still, though. Now, the only problem is now we're going to have a lot of them charging up here. So now it's kind of wrecked our strategy a little bit. We're going to have to engage them. Elephants are back. Okay, pull remaining elephants out. Hop lights. Javelins back in. Hold, hold, hold. Okay, still got a couple of the elephants stuck in there. Which is not good. I think my general's stuck in there as well. Shaking. If these guys can break, then we're okay. I'll just give them an attack order, actually, with the elephants. To try and push back through. Oh, they're making it. They're making it through. They're managing to push on up. That's it. Come on. Keep pushing on up, elephants. Keep driving. Hold the line. There we go, just managed to pull the elephants up. That'll do for now. I just keep pinning them here with the skirmishers. When some of these guys start breaking, then we'll go in with the elephants again. These guys are clearly out of the way. Let's get you guys up here. Off skirmish mode. There we go, break them all. It's the noble infantry we need you we need to break as well. Now, if we can do what we did last time, which was flank on round with the elephants, and we crush them in the back while we're pushing at the front, then we can claim another victory here. Watch out for the noble infantry. Pull them up here. Mobs, we're going to have, plebs are going to have you guys here just to push as well. If we need it, we might just be able to do this. Again. Elephants, we need you not to break. But that initial charge kept them all at bay here and held them up long enough. Now, so some people would say, you know, let them come up here and hold here. But we needed to do that and to do that initial damage to hold them, to hold them on up. We we'll have to charge in with the skirmishes soon. Come on, elephants, run, 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 run. Yep, yeah, I know. We're desperately trying to push back the noble infantry, which is the one thing that we can't really cope up against at the moment. It's their general, but if we can break their general. Right, let's start sending some of these guys in, because they are sword equipped troops, so against spears they should sort of just have a little bit of a bonus. Mob as well, go on in. Elephants are ready here. Charge. We'll give them a second win just before they go on in. Actually, no, we're not. We'll give them a, a stampede as they go on in, then second win them. 
Their general is going to go down soon. Go, go, go. Elephants, go. No, I managed to take one down. Come on. Trample, trample, trample. Go, 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 elephants. Come on. Form up, form up, form up, form up, and then we're going to charge in the back of the enemy. Come on, you've got Stampede on you. Let's make use of that charge bonus. There we go. Here we go, right in the back. They're very tired now. Second winded. There we go. And now the elephants have punched through the front, through the back, and we've won. Whoo! That tactic, though. <laughs> Continue just to try and kill as many of these guys as possible because that's the whole of the Gatuli army then dead. Well done, elephants managed to hold in there. General's still alive. Yes, they're OP, but uh, you know what? I don't care. I'm happy that we survived. <laughs> Means it shouldn't be too difficult when we get into some tricky situations with all these elephants, and I think we've managed to slaughter. Slaughter the enemy. Let me see. Interesting to see how many kills they get. I know I could check now, but I like leaving it to the end sometimes. Uh, men are celebrating. We've killed the majority of the enemy. They've run off in the battle. Elephants, 1,164 kills. Ooh. Wow. Yeah. That, that worked out well. And uh, 2,397 kills overall. The elephants got just under half the total kills of the 2,600 strong force. We really have um, destroyed them there, which is brilliant. Um, I mean, the skirmish is 301 kills there. I assume the other skirmish has probably got plenty of kills as well. Hoplites holding in there, pushing the enemy back. Now, those guys can replenish, and we're bringing, the, bringing down another army from Iol. So hopefully we can uh, use that to help out as well. Ooh, that was close. That was close for a while. For a while. I thought when they charged up, they'd get me, and went also when they managed to get my elephants. But charging them in early held them off long enough for me to position everyone, then I was able to move my units out of position. About one unit of cavalry makes it. Well done, guys. How many kills did you get then? 75, 28, 50. Okay, so you didn't get that many kills. It's these guys then that managed to pick them off. The javelin men, well done. We will uh, kill the captives. Send them back. Ah, uh, they're taking us at Tingis, where we do have elephants, of course. This is a far smaller force. Ah, uh, we do have a reasonable garrison army. This should not be a problem for us to fight, but that will be for next time, guys. So, as always, I hope you enjoyed. Please do remember to comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and I will see you all again soon. Uh, just a quick note, though, if you stayed on long enough for this video, I am live streaming tonight, Elves of Lorien, Let's Play, May the 12th, 7pm UK time. Check out my announcement video, which went up uh, a couple of days ago, for all the time conversions and what have you. Ciao for now.